The Minnesota legislature ended its regular session this past Sunday night. Now some educators at Winona State stayed up very late, almost till midnight, watching that session in hopes that the university would get funding for a state-of-the-art teaching facility there. Now they were disappointed, but there still may be some hope. News 8's Kyle Dimke has more. It was a chaotic ending to the legislative session for Minnesota Senators, to say the least. The primary amendments. Amendments. He has my amendment. I got one. He has my amendment, Mr. Speaker. Because of the chaos, Representative Gene Pulowski says a bonding bill did not pass, and Winona State University may not get the $25 million it needs to build a new village on campus this year. We passed it. It went over to the Senate and the Senate ran out of time. The Education Village is Winona State's vision of turning these three buildings just off campus into a future teacher's paradise. It will be a comprehensive program of teacher preparation where if you want to be a teacher, from the very first courses you take, you will be working with students and with teachers in private and public schools in the area. You will be developing curriculum. You will be doing things that have not been done previously by teacher preparation institutions. The university says 20% of the student body are in the College of Education. The current facilities we have for the College of Education are inadequate for um, training, educating teachers for the 21st century. The new education buildings are also in need of some work. But with a little remodeling, they could return Winona State to a university known for its education program nationwide. But in order to begin construction this year, Minnesota Governor Mark Dayton would need to call a special session. Reporting in Winona, Kyle Demke, News 8. And Governor Dayton said on Monday that he would consider calling that special session. Representative Pulowski says he does expect a special session will be called within the next few weeks.